Welcome back everybody. It's time to lock down another booster cracking Sunday and we are jumping right back into things with the second half of the Legacy Lost Box. So we already got a phenomenal J Ruler over here, but we have yet to find that Uber Rare, but we did find a God Pack. So I don't know what else is in store in this box for us, but let's find out. All right, straight away. We got a nice Spirit of Light foil, not bad. And Magic Rebound, okay. Ooh, I don't, have I seen this before? Pyrocatic Bean, wow, that's cool looking. All right, Capture in Time, there's our rare. Uh, Steam Explosion, which we've already gotten, nice full art foil. And then we got Awakened Magic Stone, the Earth as our rare, behind it, Uncommon Foil. Into the next, here we go. All right. Pretty looking foil right there. In to the rares we go, right past the uncommons, we got Yashimi, first starter of the Mikaje. Want to get her in a full art. And oh, Kayagu, uh, Kay Kayagu? <laughs> Kai Kaiguga? Kai I can't say her name right now, wow. But super rare, the Lunar Researcher, which we already got a full art of as well. Ooh, <laughs> yeah. That's a good one. Red Riding Hood. Super rare, full art. Yes, that is a good one to get. I think that's like a $7 card or something like that. That is very nice, very nice. Looks great too. Awesome. Take one from the left side here. Let's see what the left will do for us. If we can get it open, we've got Demonic Investigator. All right, we got more of the Butt Crack, Invisible Flame, Ghost of Atrashia, and we've got, oh, something new, Snow White of the Crystal Apple. Very beautiful artwork, interesting. Fire Magic Stone, and behind it we got Valentina's Reach as our foil rare, pretty cool looking card. Next pack, there we go. All right, nice bird, not a very nice bird. I don't like the birds, never have liked the birds. All right, Reunion of Sisters is our rare, and behind it, We've got Nightmare of the Ashen Dream as a full art rare. Nice, cool looking purple abyssal horse. Pretty interesting, pretty interesting. I don't know if you guys can see, but I am wearing some lockdown merch that my wife got me from Christ Christmas. Some custom printed t-shirt, which is pretty sweet. I'll have a vlog coming out soon where you can check more of that out in a future vlog video. All right, so we got Priest of Defy, Divine, whatever, Catalyst, Kuamara, Fire Water. There's our rare Valentina's Reach, which we already got in the nice foil. And we got a nice foil of Yashima, first daughter of Mikaje. Very nice. All right, next pack. Let's get into this thing. We're just gonna leave that foil thing at the bottom. Not the foil, the Force of Will points, which I don't know are exist in existence still. I have no clue how those work. Uh, oh, there's our rare. World Flame Summoning, Darkness Magic Stone, and then the stupid Broadway Cats Girl as a foil. I already got a full art of you. I don't need any more of that card. Sorry. Honestly, the crummiest card I've seen in Force of Will, in my opinion. It's got to be top tier, crummiest looking card. Sorry, not sorry. All right, what's next? Barrier Seal. We got, ooh, this little Dude, Zeng Zia, the fisherman, he's a fisherman. Nightmare of the Ashen Dream as our rare, just the regular version. Wind Magic Stone, and this guy again. We've gotten a lot of him, Runic, Runic Commander Demon. A lot of this guy. Unfortunately, he's not worth anything. So we gotta go for some better stuff here. Fishing, common, just the common fishing. Lovely, let's see, Rune of Six, we can go faster through these world flame summoning again and then we've got twin headed dragon very nice interesting looking card you can barely see the right side though look at that can barely see the right headed dragon interesting though into the next let's do this we've got death at midnight very cool fishing again we're getting lots of the fishing now that one's popping up in all our packs uh, we've got Amaruta's Foresight. That's a pretty cool card, actually. Behind it, we've got our rare Divine Beast of Atrashia, uh, Light Magic Stone, and then Magic Stone of Life Form, which we've gotten plenty of times already. Is the Uber Rare possible? Leave a like on the video if you think an Uber Rare is possible in this 
box, even though we already got a god pack? I have no clue. Maybe. There's got to be some kind of chance that it might be possible, right? It's probably unlikely. There's our rare life form again. Wow, I'm skipping. Wow, I just saw what it is. Oh my gosh, I said I'd, I don't need any more of your stupid Broadway face. I can't even... This is the quality of Force of Will. This is the quality of Force of Will. You can't even tear the cards. You can't even tear it. That's it. That's actually impressive. It's actually impressive. Force of Will, you never let me down with your quality. I will say that. As much as I really want to just tear through this dumb looking card, you, you just don't let me down. Your quality's too good. Moving on, we'll leave the dirty strands of whatever's left of the stupid Broadway cat over there, and we'll keep going for some better stuff. Uh, there she is again, but at least she looks a little bit decenter in this one. She doesn't look as dumb. I don't know. Uh, Deceptive Dream, Mage Knight, and Final Breeze as our rare Water Magic Stone, and we've got the Manticore Foil. No big deal. Not worth anything. Next one. Let's go. All right, ooh, Varia summoning as a foil. Love the look of that card, I really do. And blaze through this, Ancient Madness, blah, blah, blah. Steam Explosion again. Oh my freaking gosh, we got her again. Hey, that's a nice looking foil magic stone though. Light magic stone, can we rip through this one? See, the non-foils you can rip through. It's just the foils that are very nice and high quality, which is what we as collectors like to see. We want our foils to be nice and sturdy, nice and sturdy, and they won't bend in our binders. All right, going through to the next rare, what will it be? The Twin-Headed Dragon again, another light magic stone, and then Dimension Dragon Nidhogg as a full art, which is pretty dope. We did get him in the God Pack though. We want new things, we want new, fun, cool looking full arts. Ones that we didn't get in our third God Pack ever. If you guys hadn't seen that video yet, go back and check out the first part. It was pretty baller. There's our rare Curse of Cayuba and Darkness and Reunion of Sisters as our foil rare. Just a few more packs to go. Looks like we got a nice white horned Kachi foil. Interesting. Don't remember seeing that one. All right, Bastiat, there she is. There's our rare Snow White of the Crystal Apple again. And Fire Magic Stone. And hey, we got Guide of Light again, except not the full art, but I'll take it. That is a beautiful card nonetheless, even as the non-full art version goes. I need some good hits in these last few packs. Otherwise, our pulls of the day for this one are gonna be pretty bleak. Although, you know, we made up for it in that first video. I, I will say that. All right, Twin Hitted Dragon again, not a big deal. Uh, Dimension Dragon Nidhogg, we already got a sneak peek at what's behind it. We got Prisia's Memoria Full Art, and when I was doing my pricing for the first video, I know this one's got some value. I think it's like an eight bucker, something like that. It is a wonderful looking Memoria card. I love, 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 love this version. It is really cool, so I'm happy I got the full art of it because it does have some value, that's nice. Two more little packs, and what will we find in these little packs, I wonder? Give me something beautiful. Nightmare Dragon, we already got you, I don't want you anymore. And World Play Summoning, I already got you, I don't want you anymore. It's our last chance for an Uber Rare right here. I don't think we can get it, but you never know, right? It's not a God Pack, we already got one. Limit one per box on those. Uh... I, know, I don't think we're going to get something good here. I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling it. There's our rare Curse of Cayuba. Last card. Give me something. Okay. No, I left the top. Not a full art, but I'll take it. It is a nice foil of her. I think she's still like a $3 card in the non-foil from what I remember for the first one. I'm forgetting, but hey, that's fine. It's got some value. It'll put us over the edge of our... our uh, our price profit point, I think. I'm gonna try one more time to rip this sucker. Let's see, this is another foil, it's not the full art. Let's see if the non-full arts are different. No, they're not, they're so good. Oh, the quality is so, 
freaking good. All right, all right, we can't do this one either. All right, our pulls of the day. We didn't have a ton of them, but of course we've got our Narla at the top, which is a great card. And of course we've got our stupid Broadway cat in our foil. That's a great pull. Oh, and there goes our other one as our other foil stupid rare, non-rare foil. And of course our full art Bastiat, silly goddess cat but all right enough of that we got Prusia's memory which is a nice one to get and of course our full art red riding hood which should seal the deal uh price is up on screen for how we did today in part two of the opening i think uh we made probably not a ton in this one but we made a lot in the last episode so Price is up on screen for total amount that we got on the box in total. I think we got right over the mark of the 100 bucks. We should have. I'm hoping. I'm crossing my fingers. So if we did, make sure to leave a like. Make sure to subscribe. Stay tuned for more Force of Will openings. We got more coming up. Lots of fun stuff, so stay tuned for that. Thank you for checking out the videos. I hope you all had a great Christmas. Stay tuned for the new year. We got more exciting stuff coming. Subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next video.